My name is Korowat uh, Chiravanant and I'm the CEO and founder at Echo. So I oversee uh, leadership of the business and, uh, and the management team and all of the operations. So Echo is a London and Bangkok based company and uh, you know we're just over 100 staff now uh, but we're hiring about 100 people more right now so we're, we're scaling up. Um, so we're you know in the SaaS uh, software industry. So we provide a mobile first uh, collaboration and productivity platform for businesses. We bundle a lot of tools into one application and slash platform. So everything from chat to workflow, business process management, knowledge management, uh, learning, training management, task management, and many more. My name is David, and I'm the CTO of Echo. So we actually started off as being for large enterprises, uh, but now we, we started a huge push uh, at the end of last year to target SMEs, especially in Europe and the US. We knew that we wanted to be native to cloud from day one. Uh, so we knew that, you know, even six years ago, we look at the way the industry is developing. A lot of companies are enabled by cloud software. You know, I think cloud is really about sort of enabling new capabilities. AWS's uh, scale, cost effectiveness and everything was able to allow us uh, to, again, to provide um, the competitive pricing that forms a very core part um, of our uh, business strategy, right? The key business metric we look at is really about the cost of our infrastructure and uh, AWS is really beneficial towards that. So the biggest feature we use here is auto-scaling. So whenever we hit peak workload, we'll auto-scale up a ton of instances, sometimes a couple hundred or more. And when that workload disappears, we just instantly scale it down so we don't have to pay for it. So we only pay for what we use at all times. There are two ways that benefits our end customer. So one is the cost savings that we have through AWS, through our auto-scaling infrastructure, through the use of all the other AWS services, they definitely all translate back to cost saving for the customer. And uh, our customers, you know, they know that our solution compared to our competitor is one of the most cost-effective solutions. As a, as a SaaS business, for us, it's, it's critical um, to scale globally and, and, and quickly. And, and AWS has really enabled that, right? So, you know, we're able to spin up instances really quickly and really easily. Um, so we use it in Southeast Asia, we use uh, in, in London, we use it in the US, uh, and we also have it in China. And that's something that's, that's very important for companies that would like the data to be in, you know, maybe their country or maybe their region. And the ability to not have to pick a local cloud provider and have to rebuild so many pieces um, is really important towards uh, go-to-market, right? For scalability, um, for quality of the service, uh, and, and speed to market. I would say that AWS is definitely a startup enabler. So, you know, through its products, through its services, through its partner program, AWS has, uh, in every part of our journey, has helped us and pushed us along and, um, you know, really made us the startup that we are today. So over the last six and seven years, our experience with AWS has always been really, really great. You know, the support, um, knowledge, and know-how, and ecosystem provided uh, by AWS to us, um, even though we're still a startup and not this may not be the biggest customer, is is really, really uh, incredible. Um, and the services uh, and quality and reliability and scalability has really helped our business to accelerate um, and 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 grow and succeed. Um, and so, so I'm very grateful.